Before I go today, I'd like to take a minute to thank all of the businesses that advertise here on Channel 19. If you happen to be out and you run into one of those businesses, please thank them for supporting local television. Without them, we wouldn't be here. Now, earlier this week, Governor Rick Scott was in the southernmost city to help get the word out to the tourists that the Keys are still open for business. Before he left Key West, he said he had to take a stop at one of his favorite places to pick up a piece of their delicious key lime pie. Okay, Governor Scott, I know that Key West is one of your favorite places. How many times have you been down here? Oh, gosh, in my life? Uh -huh. A lot. I couldn't keep track of all of them. I, I love coming down here, whether it's coming to the Hemingway House or, you know, going to Sloppy Joe's or, you know, going to, I love seeing all the Mel Fisher stuff from all these ships, you know, coming down there and then all the entertainers down at Mallory Square uh, and then just, you know, going to the different restaurants. It's wonderful to be down here. Okay. And we've done the clock train tour. We've done everything you can imagine. Okay. Because I was just going to ask, I want you to be specific though. Tell me your favorite part of Key West. Oh, my favorite part of Key West, I think the key lime pie. Mm -hmm. And I'm buying one before I leave today. <laughs> I'm going to buy one and share it uh, with everybody. Uh, but I love key lime pie, and the uh, when I do um, when I do contests with other governors about foot, football games and basketball games, my bet is always a Kermit's key lime pie. <laughs> you can't come to Key West and not make a stop at Kermit's key lime pie. That's going to do it for me today. I thank you for tuning in this morning. I hope you have a great Labor Day weekend, and you can join me again here on Tuesday at 7 a.m. and then again at 8:30 a.m. Take care and have a great rest of your day.